Hey, what's up? This is Robbie from Art of Noise Audio. I wanted to show you the new composite baffle I've made. It's a little bit different than the old baffle. I'll show you the old baffle real quick. The old baffle was basically the same material as what's in on the side panels, where it's one inch core with uh, just a laminate, fiberglass laminate on both sides. And then I was trying a few different things to secure the woofer in the mid and the tweeter. And like for this one, I was experimenting with filling it in where I would just route out this area and fill it in with like a thickened epoxy. The only problem that I had with that, it would hold the screws really well, but it would add some weight to it. It would add almost as much weight as if I just used a solid piece of wood. So I don't really like that. So I wanted to design something a bit better. So what I did is this is the new one. It's two inch core instead of one inch. And I pull it out real quick. So when you thicken the core, when you make it so that the laminates are farther apart, it uh, adds stiffness to it. So being twice as thick makes it four times stiffer. So it's a lot um, better for the baffle to be really, really rigid. And also, what I did is I routed out the area for um, the ring, a plywood ring to mount in here. That way, when the screws go in, they'll have something real solid to grab onto. And it's just a one inch ring thickness, so it's really light. It doesn't add a lot of weight to it. Um, this is the mid range chamber. Just epoxy that to the back of it. And then on the front of it, the woofer is going to be recessed about, uh, about an inch. And then the mid is recessed too. That way the grill can go right over the front of it and it'll just span right over the gap. And what I can do, what that allows me to do, is I can put the grill not the grill, the baffle, right to the front of the cabinet so that there's only maybe an eighth of an inch or a quarter of an inch uh, between the front of the cab and the baffle. And that'll keep the same outside dimensions. I don't have to make the cabinet any bigger and it'll keep the same inside dimensions. So it's kind of a win-win. Uh, and as you see, it's really light. So you get the job done. Alright, thanks.